Demonstration of Undertracks, a web platform dedicated to capitalization of data, operators, and analysis processes about interactions between men and computer, particularly in uh, learning environments. This demonstration will show the benefits to have data analysis processes and operators linked together in the same environment. Apart, there is a first demonstration with a focus on data and the second with a focus on analysis processes. About data, in the first demonstration we have shown how we can capitalize and share data obtained from interactions between students and the learning environments and to the Undertracks platform. But data alone are useless, so in that first demonstration we have created what we call a study with data, metadata and information. In the second video, about analysis processes, we have shown how we can edit, execute and capitalize and share analysis processes. In that second uh, demonstration, we have shown also how to add information about analysis processes and how analysis processes can be linked to data operators and results. That second demonstration have used UT Arrange, a clone of the Arrange software dedicated to our platform. In both demonstrations, we argue on the importance of information and link. We will not stress the importance of information, but that's crucial. Here is a partial map of the website, uh, the platform, with uh, some links. Most are automatically constructed, available, some links available on the Undertax platform. There are four kinds of node. Node for standard page, for navigation, for home page, for list of content, documentation, and so on. We have node here, uh, there, like a repertory for uh, studies and data. We have node here for analysis processes, these links, and we have short nodes for operators, sort here, for example. And between uh, all these nodes, links, a lot of links, in fact, but uh, not uh, links everywhere from uh, from everywhere to everywhere else. Links, in fact, uh, that's very good to understand or to have information about data operators and analysis processes, but we have to uh, have some uh, uh, meaning for, for this link, or so for some reason to make these links. And in fact, in these links, we have we show The same thing that we have shown in other paper about the data and operator life cycle. The data life cycle here is to prepare, collect, validate, enrich, and analyze data. The operator ci life cycle is about design, de develop, validate, and analyze data cycle. And uh, so we can see that both cycles meet at the analysis. And if we uh, see here, in fact, uh, and uh, focus on one analysis processes, this one for example or another, what we see is that there is a link from analysis processes to data and a link from the analysis processes to the operator. So something like that for every data used in the analysis processes, for every operator used in the analysis processes. So the platform 
uh, is some verification of what we have shown in a paper. The second thing we want to show is the benefit we have to put all these elements, data, operator, analysis, processing, together in the same environment. Because it permits to improve each of these elements. Here is an example. At the beginning, we need to compute a, a formula, uh, R2, R square, um, here, with our operator. And for our data, uh, that was not easy because of the data, which was not very clean, and because of our operators, uh, which are not very clever. So we have um, uh, analyzed our analysis processes and we thought about new operators to make the end simpler. So we have introduced new operator in our platform for that purpose and we get a new op analysis op process simpler. But that was not enough. In a second time, uh, we thought about the data. The first part, in fact, of uh, the analysis processes uh, was uh, to uh, select some part of the data, uh, record some part, and so on, and join information from another source of data. Uh, that's because the data at the beginning was not very clean. So what we thought about was to cut the analysis process in two, the first part, to pre-process data and the second one to uh, make the analysis we wanted to do. At the end of the first part, in fact, what we have done is to produce another set of data and introduce this data in the platform. So we have get new improved data on the platform and from this, that new data we have a process which was much simpler. Almost it was uh, linear. Next, um, uh, what we see on the, what you can see is that um, there is, in fact, some important operator, name description, uh, correlation, that is statistic operators, and some other operator uh, record substitution, uh, sort, select, which are mm, some tools uh, which are not very important. So what we can s we have think about uh, or dream about uh, is to maybe improve the operator, the main operator, to have uh, all these small things done within select, record, sort. Uh, We have not done the improved operator, but we think about and at the end, with this new operator, improved operator, what we uh, what we could be the analysis process it would be a very simple one with only an operator to get the data, one operator to make some statistical uh, computation, and at the end, process uh, uh, correlation. Um, calculus. So at the end what we get is a, would be a straight process, analysis process with only three operators, but also new operators, that's the first operator we done at the first phases of the program. New data, new improved data, and maybe new improved operators. And that's mostly possible that's mostly possible thanks to the fact that all these elements, data, operators and analysis processes, were all together in that same environment with a uh, possibility to uh, act on each one and improve and change and edit all these elements. And that's the end of that third video about under tracks, demonstration about under tracks.